Well, um, I rode at Georgia Tech in uh, August 2007, so it's been about 10 year, 10 year journey for me to graduate from Tech. I did a, instead of taking classes, I did a work abroad. So I went to Morocco to work abroad through an organization called ISIC. And then when I came back to thinking that I would have my co-op, unfortunately, due to like restructuring or budget or whatever it was, um, I no longer had that co-op. So I had to take that semester off. In 13, I've been paying out of pocket and I've had a full-time job since December of 2012 up until June of last year. And I was working full-time at Bank of America overnight and taking full-time classes during the day. So I took this one class that was a big uh, <laughs> roadblock for me to, to the road to graduation, which was um, EC3040, which is microelectronics. And so I finally passed that class last semester, and now I'm finally able to walk and everything. The school of EC was really helpful in that sense that um, they understood my situation. And that's one thing I'd always definitely recommend for anybody else going through something. Reach out to your faculty and advisors. They're definitely there to help you. And it's because of them that I'm actually able to graduate too, because they work with me a lot. That year I took off, like really did a lot of self-reflecting, a lot of just perseverance basically. So like on my graduating camp I actually have perseverance as one of the words that allowed me to actually persevere through all those ordeals and obstacles to actually be at the point where I am now to be able to have a job, offer from graduation and be able to graduate. And Basically, my parents were my foundation for that, so with the opportunities that I'm getting with job offers and what I'm going to be able to do after I graduate, it's definitely been well worth it, even though it's been almost twice as long as a normal tech student, the four to five year versus me, nine to ten years. Tech will give you the best return on investment, hands down, for a public institution, so definitely wanted to make sure they lived up to that name, so here I am today.